This morning we released our full year results in which we set out our review of 2014 and I wanted to take a few moments to talk about some of the key points. The halving of the oil price over the past eight months has had a significant impact on the industry. It's forced many companies to defer or cancel projects and reassess their cost bases, making it more challenging to secure investment for new projects. Not surprisingly, this may impact us as we structure the funding for Bentley, but the scale of the opportunity and the extent of the work we've completed to date have helped us to keep the project moving forwards. So let's just remind ourselves that we have one of the largest undeveloped assets in the UK North Sea, which has robust economics. We have spent a significant amount of capital so far, more than $400 million, to appraise it and evaluate it, so we understand it very well. We've been working with the development group to further validate the asset and optimise the development plan. And much of the work we've done over the past year has been focused on this. We have a collaborative business model, which we believe will help us to deliver this project on time and on budget. Clearly two key areas of focus for the industry at the moment. And we continue to adapt to the industry environment and we continue to create opportunities to achieve our goal of developing Bentley. So in summary then, Despite this challenging environment, we have a great asset, a detailed understanding of it, and a cost-effective and efficient development plan. And because of this, we remain confident about the viability of the project and our ability to move it forwards. Finally, the impact of the budget last week. Of course, we welcome proposed changes and believe they're a step in the right direction and should be helpful for the industry as a whole. We're updating our reserves report which will be finalised in due course and will include the impact of these beneficial fiscal changes on the Bentley field. Once again, I'd encourage shareholders to pay attention to the company's news flow and not to the ill-informed market speculation. And of course, we'll provide updates as we have news to share. Thank you for your time.